Hey guys, welcome to Alice Every Day. Today I'm going to teach you how to build a simple bathroom cabinet. So guys, welcome to another build and today we're going to build a bathroom cabinet or vanity cabin, however you want to call it. Now this is a very straightforward build. I'm going to use three MDF boards that are four feet by two. It's just what I decided to build on. I was going to go with plywood, but it's going to be too heavy. And since the walls uh, in my bathroom are not that sturdy, I decided to go with MDF. Now, basically we're just building a cube and including the top that we're going to cut in the middle for the door. And then we're just going to build some shelves. Now, if you want actual specifications, my sides are actually cutting out six and a half inches, and then my shelves are going to be six inch deep, and wide is going to be two feet, and tall is going to be three feet. Now, I am going to make my top shelf, actually the little cover on the top, uh, two inches wider than the two feet, so that way they overlap just a little bit, and it gives it a nice style. Now, I do recommend to just go off by a little sketch, make yourself a sketch so you know what to cut. Now I'm also choosing not to cover the bottom shelf, I think it just gives it a great look. You can cover it if you want, you might need a little extra wood for it, but I'm not going to cover it so my door is actually going to cover the top three shelves and leaving the bottom one exposed. Now to get the sides I am going to apply some glue and I'm just going to hit it with a lot of nails. Now these are just brad nails that I have. Please always safety first, do not put your fingers anywhere near it because they can shoot out anywhere they want to go. Now I did miss a couple of these nails and you're going to see later on that I, I just pulled it out, fixed it and put a new one right in. Now if they do go to the back it doesn't matter because it's just the back and nobody's going to see it, but you do want to keep the insides very nice and neat.
Now here I am adding that two extra inches to the top part so it actually gives it a nice look of just a little bit of overhang. Now since this is MDF, I do recommend you to give it a primer first, as I did, and then give it about two coats of nice, two heavy coats of white after. You can paint it whatever color you like. Now for the door, I originally said I was going to make it just one piece door, but I decided it's going to be too heavy, so I cut it in half, and I started just drilling the holes for the hinges. Make sure you attach your hinges, don't go through the entire door, and you're pretty much good to go. Make sure you do adjust your hinges to make the doors actually straight and you're good to go. So there you go guys, I hope you enjoyed this project. It was very straightforward and simple to build. Um, it, it looks very nice. We're gonna go hang it up in our bathroom. Um, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next build.